Recalibre. Ecotools and youth work for collective creativity. Hi, welcome to this Recalibre video tutorial on a method we call All Different, All Equal Reloaded. All Different, All Equal Reloaded is a getting to know each other activity that is based on finding similarities and differences between group members and expressing them by short, non-verbal theatrical sketches or miming. The other group members have to guess what similarity or difference is displayed. It is a fun way of breaking the ice and finding out about each other while at the same time engaging in a collective creative and playful process. This method requires a group size of minimum 6 people and can be scaled up to 30 people. Depending on the group size, the duration could be 15 to 20 minutes of instruction of participants and giving them time to prepare the performances. 20 minutes of showcasing the performances and 10 minutes of debriefing, so around 45 minutes in total. No materials are required other than space. Optionally, props, stationery and audio equipment can be offered. For preparation, all you need is to secure is space. And you might want to prepare a flip chart or a handout with instructions. To implement the activity, First, divide the participants in groups of three to six people. You will need at least two groups for this activity, but it can also be more. Next, instruct the participants with the following task. Step one, find one thing that all from your group have in common. Prepare a short, non-verbal theatrical sketch or miming performance to later present it to the other groups. Step two, find one unique thing about each member of your group this could be, for example, a hobby or a fun fact. And again, prepare a presentation of it with means of a non-verbal theatrical sketch or miming to later present it to the other groups. You will now have 15 minutes to prepare and rehearse. As you announced, give 15 minutes to the groups to prepare their performances. If you have it available, you can also offer props, stationery and a sound system to the groups. If the space allows for it, the groups can also use different locations to prepare and rehearse, so the different groups cannot see each other and thus avoid spoilers on the upcoming performances. After 15 minutes, get the groups together and sort out the order of the groups to perform. Before the start of each set of performances, make sure both actors and audience are attentive and ready. After each performance, Ask the other groups to guess what was the similarity or uniqueness displayed and make sure it is eventually guessed by the audience or revealed by the actors. Repeat until all groups have shown their performances and guessing and revelations have successfully taken place. There is not too much to debrief on the activity, as the main purpose is to learn about each other's similarities and uniqueness and to enjoy a creative and playful process together to establish connections. You might want to round up the exercise by asking the participants to find one thing that actually all of them share, not just in the subgroups, but as a group as a whole. You might also want to ask the participants how unique or similar they feel to each other and how they feel about being united in diversity. You might even want to task the participants with finding a name or motto for them. A possible variation on the exercise is to not split into smaller groups, but stay as a whole group and stand in a circle. You then offer the possibility to a volunteer to come to the middle and say a statement about him or herself that is true. For example, I like or I do not like chocolate. In case the statement is also true for other participants in the circle, they are invited to establish a physical connection with the volunteer in the middle, for example by putting their hand on the shoulder of the volunteer or of somebody else who put their hand on the shoulder of the volunteer and say, me too, and then step back to their position in the circle. This is repeated by the volunteer in the middle until he or she finds a statement that is only true for him or herself, so where no other participant would touch their shoulder or establish another type of connection and say, me too. The volunteer in the middle would then be free to leave the middle, having said something unique where nobody else says me too, and join back the circle. And another volunteer may step to the middle to repeat the exercise. This way you can quickly find out about connections and similarities in the group, as well as about what makes each of us unique. 
All different, all equal reloaded is quite an easy and straightforward method and may be implemented by any youth worker with any level of experience. It is especially suitable for groups who are just in the face of getting to know each other and who have a joint journey ahead.